Hey guys, Ron Smiley here. Just want to get you up to speed on what we expect over the afternoon and the overnight hours. We are expecting some pretty big rain totals overnight, and that's going to be the big concern. That's why we also have the flood watches. Now, there is actually a difference in an aerial flood watch and a normal flood watch. A normal flood watch means that we could see rapidly rising water. That's mainly looking at places like in the streets of downtown Pittsburgh and other areas that we're looking for. The aerial flood watch, the water rises slowly and it stays around longer. Generally we're talking about kind of river flooding and river or water that's out of the banks of rivers when we're talking about aerial flooding. Both of those will be possible over the next 48 hours. We're going to watch closely for that. Look at the latest numbers coming in from model data and just how big some of these totals are. We're generally saying about one and a half inch to two inches of rain should be expected into the overnight hours, really wrapping up at about seven or eight o'clock on Friday morning. You can see those totals there. There are some that are showing more than two inches. I think that when we're waking up on Friday morning, we'll likely see some areas like that. Probably not as big as what that one particular model is showing, but those are gonna be the areas that we're really gonna have a big uh, concern with when it comes to the impact of flooding. That means uh, not just roads that could be flooded, but people's yards and homes as well. That's gonna be the big concern. So here's what you need to know. Stay weather aware as you're heading into the overnight hours. Make sure you have the weather radio on or that you are tuned in and know what's going on, especially if you're in a low-lying area. Remember, early, especially into the overnight hours, turn around, don't drown. If you see a road that has water on it, just turn around. Don't try to go through that at all. Just turn around and be safe. The water's gonna go down. Just let it do that. More rain certainly on the way also before the end of the weekend. Looks like on Sunday we'll have another chance for rain. For today, 65, your expected high. Check out the rest of the, uh, well, the next 24 hours there with your temperature slowly going down behind that cold front uh, that'll slide through. Most of the day on Friday will actually, at least in the afternoon, will be into the mid to low 30s. Hey, I'm on at noon, and then Jeff and John are around later on tonight, 4, 5, 6 in the late shows. Hope you catch us there for a complete look at your forecast.